I was this this question of of uh, of meaning kind of haunted me. What 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 could I possibly do that would have any lasting or enduring meaning? It was not really based on science initially. I started having weird existential questions when I was 14 years old after I'd broken my leg in a skiing accident. And oh. questions like, well, what's it going to matter in 100 years? Do it, you have in your mind, are you certain? Am I certain? I have had experiences of God that make me um, m more Confident. Can you tell uh, yeah. me those experiences? Yeah. Um, I uh, I don't think this is unique to uh, people who have religious belief, but one of the things that um, the the Hebrew Bible and the New Testament talk about is the role of the Spirit of God or the Holy Spirit. That what is objectively real in history is made subjectively real or confirmed subjectively by the testimony of the Holy Spirit. That's something, so I have an inner confidence about my faith right. in God. Right, well, how, how have you experienced it though? Um, uh, I have heard non-audible voices, um, and the things I don't hear audibly, but uh, words that come into my head that I am immediately aware are not f generated by my own thought processes. How can you be sure? Can't be sure. Except why do you that, believe that? Well, I because the imagination is so fertile. It is fertile, Joe. Um, and so you have to test these things. But I've had specific, this only happened to me a few times, but they've been words of guidance about the direction that my life is going to take or needs to take. 